tonight we're eating like locals at Ho Thai Kai Food Street. Let's go. So these are basically a uh, rice cake pizza base and they've got some delights on the top. Oh. Oh. thousand dong for both of those the rice paper pizza and the sausage so we'll try them and uh, let you know what they're like all right we'll give the sausage a bit of a run Lena's had a go already pretty happy with it mmm good snap great flavor mm. really good not dripping with fat sausage it's got a spice mix on the outside They're really nice I'll try some of this rice paper pizza mm. pretty good also you really do get that flavor coming through from the grill so that's a plus that's why always cooking over flame you're always going to get something different than just doing it over a, uh, a planter or in a saucepan so that's why we love eating food over flame you get that flame kissed smoky flavor delightful and even on a rice cake like this still comes through makes all the difference all right we'll finish these we'll find something else so, i don't know what he's got here but okay well there's some toastiness underneath so we got the delicious chili sprinkled on the top They're hot. Bloody hell, man. They're good. Are they hot? The lads at the stall are laughing because I've just eaten it and it's come straight off the grill. Lena's laughing at me as well, going, You freaking dickhead. Look how hot that was and you're into it and you burn your roof in your mouth. Over here. <laughs> the lad running the stall said we might need a beer. I think he's right. We'll uh, order some beverages. Yeah, we'll come back when they've cooled down a bit and my blister on the roof of my mouth is healed. It's cooled down enough now, I've had another couple of bits. Got the safety beer on standby, ready to go, so it's covered in chilli. It's not so hot, but it's bloody delicious.
water in with a lady? Uh, I don't. Heck, okay. Yo, yo, yo. Is that 142? Oh, no. Yeah. That's it. 142 only. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Right. So all this food's just arrived. We had a bit of lost in translation action. No cheese. Yeah, there is. We've got two beef sticks. We've got pork balls. Chicken. Beetle leaf wrapped with beef, like five or six squid skewers. We've got this, which I'm not really sure what it is, but we'll do some research and I'll let you know. And a couple of sauces, and all of this was less than 150,000 dong. Which is absolutely amazing. All right, we're going to get stuck into this. I'll let you know. Sauce is good. Yeah. Oh. Give these little squidlies a bit of a run. Lena said the green sauce over here, pretty mint. Spicy. Yeah, and they're so tender, that's awesome. Good ones here. Beef wrapped in beetle leaf. See you mate, cheers! This beef here is absolutely smothered in lemongrass. It's got the char, it's amazing. Wow, what a treat. Okay, so I don't know what the name of this one is. There's egg, there's a big prawn underneath. It's been cooked in a little, uh, like a ceramic pot over the charcoal there's egg there's oysters and some other stuff if someone knows what this is the name of it please let me know in the comments we'll have a give it a little crack and see how it goes mm. it's almost like a lobster mornay sauce with corn in it Got that eggy with the creaminess. Man, that's really good. Really good. Not what you expect from Vietnamese and not from over a flame grill, man. That's something totally out of the box. I've never tried before, never seen before. Fantastic. They're awesome. So Lena's just having a try of these. Beetle leaf. This is what they look like. It's uh, beef wrapped in beetle leaf. Mince inside, leaf on the outside. We've got a selection of really hot and spicy sauces. The green one's the hottest. I see the chili in the red container. The other one's a bit more like a uh, nook jam or a sweet chili sauce, a Vietnamese sweet chili sauce. Are these amazing? The char on this beef wrapped in beetle leaf is absolutely amazing and it really flows through to the meat inside. It's a fantastic bite. What a great idea, man. What a great food invention. Plates are done. Lena's done. We've just seen the little house, mate. Here he is. There's a lovely lady to help us out, the boss that cooked it all. Man, this is the best feed we've had so far in uh, Ho Chi Minh. Absolutely amazing. And an absolute sweetheart. I got it there, baby. I got it. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so we're just about to leave. We've had a fantastic feed. On the way out, I found this rotisserie of amazement. All over coals, flame grilled, would taste amazing. This is a next visit special for sure. Okay. 
octopus tentacles, skewers, chicken wings, oh, sausage intestines. It's all the food groups. Oh, ribs, sausage, little quails. Wow. We do have to come back here for sure. Not this visit, but we've got another trip planned back here in a few months, so this will be the first place to have a feed for sure. All right. visit to Ho Chi Minh you're staying in district one in D1 get out of your comfort zone mix it with the locals like us the food is about a third of the price and three times as nice man it's absolutely amazing I'll uh, put a location pin for this one for sure in the description and I'll chuck up a, uh, a Google Maps on the screen now so you can see exactly where we are there's probably about 5% tourists and the rest are all locals man they know a good thing is Tuesday night, it's not Saturday or Sunday night, it's Tuesday and it's even like this. So yeah, they know something good, they know there's something good on and they're all over it. So yeah, get down here, it's fantastic. This is the best feed we've had so far, without a doubt.